Pet Food Forum TV here on day one of the Pet Food Forum 2017. Joining me now is my guest, Justin Emig. Justin, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. You are the Director of Search Marketing for Web, Web Talent, Talent Marketing. Marketing. That is correct. Excellent. That and is correct. Uh, you had a presentation today. I did. Tell us how it went. Or tell us what it was about first. A lot of what the presentation was about was social media. The elephant in the room, as you yeah. could say. Uh, social media is not going anywhere. Uh, so but one of the problems with social media is it's generally digital. Uh, so retailers feel that it's not them. They can't use social media because it's not a traditional medium. Right. Uh, I feel that's, that's inaccurate. Right. Um, so a lot of it was that intersection of retail and digital and how you can leverage social to do that. And did you also talk about brands selling direct to consumers? I did. Yes. I did. So, and, and retailers as well? That is correct. Okay. That is correct. Social commerce, I guess, is the word everybody okay. uses for it. Sure. Um, so, yes, we talked about that a little bit. Interesting trend uh, in the United States. It's not necessarily something that's very popular. Uh, as far as consumer adoption, okay. the networks are trying. Facebook has been trying since 2014 to sell us information or sell us products from Facebook. Uh, unfortunately, consumers aren't responding. Why so, is that, do you know? There's a lot of theories behind it. I feel that the one that holds those merit is payment. So if you're, we, we're just recently becoming comfortable with paying from our phones. And social is almost an exclusively mobile platform. Right. So we're kind of nervous about paying from our phones. And you know, I think that in the United States, that's one of the reasons. If we could buy from our phone, now we're starting to with Amazon one click. Sure. We're getting there, we're just a lot slower. 